Teshi Freed. I'm at the ROI convention in Kfar Machbia, Israel. That's who I am, new media from the U.S. I know there's a lot of talk about what's going on at this convention, but all I really care about, all I actually care about is the food. It's really all that's important to me. The convention, ah, conventions are conventions. What, you sit by a roadside motel and you talk about strategy and issues and these things, which mean really nothing to anyone, and I know everyone else is here about the food. Because they sit there at the end of the track sessions, and they can't wait for the food. And I'm going to give you a little tour of what's going on with the food. Would you like to say hi to the camera? Very famous blogger, Esther Kostanowicz. That's right. What do you have? glamour. Wow. I'm going to have some meat because I'm powering up for a workshop. Wow. Yeah. I guess she doesn't care about animal rights, as do Israelis in general not care about animal rights. Look at all this meat right here. Mmm. They also like to love the starches, man. This is the hot section. But that's not really what we're here for. Soups. Breads. The really left-wing section. Vegetarian. Gluten-free pasta. The gluten-free people are taking over the so world. Gluten-free pasta? What is gluten-free pasta? Yum. To mess with the establishment of pasta, just completely out of line, man. They can take the pizza, they can take whatever, but pasta, pasta is gluten. That's the epitome of gluten. Look at the salads. Look at that dessert, man. That's just a heart attack waiting to happen right there. That's why they get fruit, to make you feel good about yourself. Mmm, fruit. Pie. Man. Can you imagine driving down the road to a settlement and having a pie stand? Maybe they could do like an interfaith Palestinian Israelis selling apple pie on the side of the road. That would be kind of nice, wouldn't it? Pies. Look at the salads. Oh. Look at that color. Plethora of color. Plethora. Oh, really. Pickles, cucumbers, Israeli salad. Everyone's networking. Bean sprouts, man. Look at this color, man. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful color. And more salads. You'll notice something very disturbing about the salads. You know what's disturbing about these salads? For people who don't like cilantro, yeah. it's terrible. Everything's got cilantro. Cilantro, 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 cilantro. What is cilantro? Everything. It's this spice that they put in everything in Israel. Where, wait, which one? This one? Right here. These these little things. That's cilantro and the, and this and that. <laughs> Yesterday was even worse. They had a uh, they had a cilantro salad. It's a it was. They put it like on dude. They had just a only cilantro salad. Who are you? I'm Eric. You're gonna be I'm on the, YouTube. The French guy from Luxembourg. I'm the only one from Luxembourg. Luxembourg. There's like 56,000 people in Luxembourg. A little bit more. Come on. There's 100,000 people living in the city, including a thousand Jews, and I'm proud to be one of them. You're you're the only person I'll probably ever meet from Luxembourg. Cool. Now we need someone from Liechtenstein. That's the other small country, right? Oh, really? <laughs> okay. Look at this salads, man. This stuff. I tried it. It looks much better than it is. Look at this. It's like a cilantro proliferation, man. That looks like basil. We're back to the uh, vegetables. And uh, that's it. Reporting, reporting live in Kapar Machia, where the food is amazing. And the conversation is just glowing. Oh my god, look at that food. I'm going, I'm going.